Culinary is that moment that I can actually be myself. So you go in, you cook, you let everything go at the door. It gives you that outburst of creativity where it can, you can be you with your food. When I try to think of life without culinary, it's like kind of a hard thing of where would I be? It was during my senior year that I heard about the Cooking Up Change program. Well, Cooking Up Change is a, it's a project. It's an exercise in which our culinary arts students are uh, learning what it takes to actually produce a meal that's served in our cafeterias. It can be only so many steps, so it can be replicated in other cafeterias. It has to follow USDA's guidelines. It only costs about a dollar to produce um, and um, tastes good. Students are learning what it takes to actually produce such a meal. They are more about health. You can't add no salt, like no sugar. Like you can't add that. But that's the thing that people expect out of chefs though. Like I bet you any chef you speak to could give you a time where they had limited ingredients and someone just was like, make that taste good. And when I realized people actually liked my food and liked how I was making my food uh, out of my vision, it actually made me like, yeah, I'm actually pretty good at what I do. Like, I felt like I had a big voice and I had a big say so on what was going on next as far as food choices. When uh, Cooking Up Change menu items are on the uh, lines in our cafeterias, students are often picking that first. When it came that time where I was like, oh, you're going to DC, I was just like, I don't think I'm ready. I don't think I'm cut for this. The eyes are like, I always like opportunities for students to get away from their neighborhood. Some of them have never been past 15 blocks of their house, to be honest with you. So it's a big deal. And then when it hits them, like, man, I just presented on the Senate floor. I was like, yeah, you were in a hearing. And you presented, and all these lobbyists and policymakers got a chance to listen to you. If you have access to good food, you will be more alert and more ready to learn. Some students are actually preaching that and going out as like soldiers of, you know, there's other healthier lifestyles out there than what we have as, as teenagers. We play second in the national competition. When I came back from D.C., I felt like a whole totally different person. And now I'm back and I feel like I can just do anything. It was one of the proudest moments of my life. Let's start cooking better for the children that we serve. If we can get everybody to start doing that, then you know what a better place we could be.